So it doesn't matter how good you may eat, if you can't absorb the nutrients, it's not gonna do any good. So in the cases where I was taking those 80 supplements every single day, they weren't breaking down into my body because my stomach couldn't break them down. And then on top of that, they weren't getting absorbed. So they were a big, huge waste of money and time and energy. Welcome to yourbrilliance.com. I'm your host, Amy Waterman. So let me start out with a personal confession. I, like 133 million Americans, have a chronic health condition. And many of my friends have chronic health conditions. They've got thyroid issues or diabetes or fibromyalgia. And some of us were diagnosed several decades ago, but others are only now just finding out why they felt terrible for so long. Because here's the thing. Nobody can look at us and say, oh, they're sick. We should give them a break. Instead, we live the same lives as everyone else. You know, we've got work, we've got family, homes, children, while also living with a health condition that requires basically full-time management. I tell people it's like having the flu, but seven days a week for the rest of your life. You have to be so careful with your energy. You can't slip up on diet or sleep or else you really pay for it. So we're always looking for some kind of relief, you know, some way to make our lives easier and our health burdens lighter. And that is where our guest for today comes in. Maria Aparis is a health and wellness mentor and the author of the book, The Essential Gut Awakening, Mastering Hashimoto's and Other Autoimmune Diseases. She specializes in natural, holistic, and alternative modalities for optimum wellness. She's an expert massage therapist, a Kundalini yoga and meditation instructor, and a Reiki healer. Welcome, Maria. Thank you. Well, thank, I'm so excited to be here to talk about this incredible subject that so many people struggle with. Well, what I really love about it is, like I said, I have a very personal stake in this. I have a lot of people who are really excited about watching this video once it's up. But where I want to start out with is your personal story. So things were going wrong for you. You went to the doctor and like so many of us, like me, like everyone, you got nothing. Well, not only did I get nothing, I got kind of a runaround from different doctors and specialists. The first doctor that I went to told me that I was just getting older and I needed to exercise more. And so I did. And what I based on my doctor's advice, almost nearly died because I had anemia. My blood level was uh, down to 3.3. And uh, that's really critical and beyond blood transfusion. Right? That's a trip to the ER. And so my doctor, without even testing my blood or anything, just really scooted me out of the office to say that, you know, you're just getting older. So what I did is I took that and exercised even harder, thinking that these, these pounds that were coming on, that this fatigue was because I was getting, I was out of shape, right? That I was getting older. So that mantra became what kept me hiking and running, but really coming home and just crashing. And it was those kinds of, of doctor's advices if I'm saying that right, um, that really nearly killed me. <laughs> so, so I have been through so many doctors and specialists and naturopaths and acupuncturists and uh, Ayurveda, uh, chiropractors. Everyone was trying their best um, or the best of their ability and nothing was working. And so it was when I actually went back to plant allies, that everything started to shift. So I want to contrast that to your life before. So you eventually ended up getting diagnosed with Hashimoto's. What was your like before all this started happening? So my life was me um, doing red carpet. I was a full-time uh, model, print model. So I did, I was a size two to a size four my entire life. So to give you some perspective of what that looked like, I went from a size two to a size 12 in about three months. So the weight gain came on super fast. Um, this really indigestion, bloating, fatigue, insomnia, um, uh, gosh, vertigo. Um, I had a tumor the, the size of a golf ball in my throat. 
I couldn't model anymore because, you know, I was too tired and I, I couldn't fit in anything anymore. And um, red carpet events, those were gone. Um, so a lot of my beautiful, glamorous life was completely halted and became everything in terms of just trying to survive. And I lost a lot of stuff. I lost many accounts that I had. Um, money wasn't coming in from the print anymore. And money was going out for endless amount of supplements. Um, things that, that every single, I, at one point I was taking 80 different supplements a day. Now, and I was also getting my blood tested every three weeks because every time you try something new, the doctor wants to make sure it's working or not and then adjust it. So I was going broke. I was spending so much money trying, and because also none of this stuff is under um, uh, insurance, mm -hmm. under my insurance plan. So I was paying for private insurance, plus going out of pocket for all of these other expenses, and then taking up to 80 different supplements a day. Now, on top of that, one doctor told me to take progesterone cream because my hormones were out of whack. So she said that I had an overabundance of estrogen. So instead of leveling it out, she told me to take progesterone to combat it, right? For me, that was not the answer because that gave me my cycle every 10 days for 14 days. <sighs> and it was excruciating. And so now add in tampons, <laughs> pads, all of this hygiene that I had to use every 14 days. I mean, every 10 days for 14 days. And so when you add up like beautiful life beforehand and then life during, it was completely chaos for me. And feeling like, I mean, I, I felt depressed. I felt so sad. I felt despondent. Um, I felt like I was never gonna get my life back. And it was so incredible to feel that change from feeling like, like the lowest point of my life to getting it back really quickly with plant allies and mindset. Because in the worst days, even though I knew it, it, I felt awful, there was some spark of light inside my, my being that was not going to accept that this was going to be the rest of my life. So that's where I dug in. That's fantastic. So I want to know more about that. But first, I know that not everybody knows what Hashimoto's is. Could you give us a quick breakdown on what that entails? Sure. So Hashimoto's, the way that doctors describe it, is when your immune system is attacking your thyroid. But what I want to discover on is that the really the core of Hashimoto's and any autoimmune disease is leaky gut syndrome and that all the wellness begins in our gut. So because I wasn't absorbing any of these supplements, I had done years of damage with coffees, espressos, eating processed foods, mm. non-organic foods. When I went and changed my lifestyle, I changed my supplements, changed everything, that's when my body started to heal from the inside out. So that's really shocking because, you know, so I will admit I have gone on that, on that supplement, you know, thing where you're spending $20 a bottle and it's a one month supply and then you don't feel any different and they say, we'll keep on going. And you're like, how do you know? And to think that you were taking all those things and they weren't getting absorbed because of leaky gut. It's yes. devastating. So tell us a little bit, what is leaky gut? How, how does that work? Okay, so in our stomach, we have this lining, right? And it's, um, it's a cilia lining, and it keeps everything, I don't know if you can see my fingers, but it keeps everything closed and tight, right? That's where we want it. But unfortunately, with as toxins, environmental toxins, um, stress toxins, endotoxins, um, toxins that we eat, the stomach lining starts to break down, and it starts to form like these little gaps. Now, when you get those toxins into your body, they get into the stomach lining, and then they enter the bloodstream, right? So let's say the, this is the bloodstream from here down. So when they start to get into the bloodstream, then your body's natural response, like say you get a cut on your finger, 
your natural response is your, you send heat and blood circulation to that area because the body will, thinks that there might be an infection or a virus, right? So it starts to go in there and to raise that inflammation. It's a natural body response. It's actually a good thing. The challenge is, is that when you have leaky gut, it's as if you had those cuts all over your stomach and in your gut. And so your body thinks that you, you have to send in the troops to combat that, right? So what that does is it raises all of the inflammatory response in your body. The histamines, everything just goes into this hyperdrive. And your body doesn't know what's good and what's bad. It attacks everything in that area. So your body starts to, in a sense, attack itself and it goes towards the weakest link. And that, that might be your pancreas, your, your, your thyroid, um, your central nervous system. It could be anything that's at the weakest link in your body at that time. So that's why sometimes autoimmune diseases may start at with one, but then continue to go on and on if you don't correct that leaky gut. Okay, so I want to know then, how did you finally start to get a handle on managing your Hashimoto's? Like, what are the plant allies about? Okay, so the plant allies, your body accepts them because there's no synthetics. But I want to backtrack just a little bit because what we really want to focus on is absorption, right? So anything that we get absorbed into the body and, and what I was missing was vital nutrients that were just not getting absorbed. So it doesn't matter how good you may eat, if you can't absorb the nutrients, it's not gonna do any good. So in the cases where I was taking those 80 supplements every single day, they weren't breaking down into my body because my stomach couldn't break them down. And then on top of that, they weren't getting absorbed. So they were a big, huge waste of money and time and energy. So that's one of the reasons why I wrote my book, because I really want to help people um, understand that absorption is the key to everything. So whether it's good absorption of, of, of good things that help us or absorption of toxic things that, things um, that make us worse or sick. So both of those things get absorbed into the body or not absorbed. So we're looking for supplements. If you are going to take supplements, which I have found great ones now, but it took a long time. We're looking for those supplements that actually get absorbed. So they're nano-enhanced liposomal, and that means that they're water-soluble, right? So they basically are pre-broken down. Once they hit the gut, they're easily absorbed because they're not dense, right? So those supplements that we were taking were so firm and solid and not absorbable that I was basically eliminating as they went out. But the, the, within three days of taking water soluble, which is nano enhanced liposomal delivery of, of these supplements, my health started to change within three days because I could get, I was like, whoa, I woke up with energy. I wasn't hitting the snooze button every two seconds. Um, these, these supplements changed my life. So one of these ways that you can get plant allies into your life is through essential oils. I am a huge advocate of essential oils, and I knew nothing about them before. So essential oils that worked for me, the first one was a very grounding blend. And I had, you know, I, when I, I had a massage therapist who came in and said, can I use this on you? I was like, you can use Exxon. I don't care. You can use, what is it, DW40? I don't care. I just need to get this done so I can go home and go to bed, right? So she used this oil and my whole senses just, just opened up and my, my body felt calm and peace for the first time. And what happens is, is that you inhale these, these, these natural plant allies, these essential oils, they go into your limbic system and it released like this calmness. So this along with hemp, hemp extract has changed my life significantly. And I found a brand of both that are the most powerful and most potent and the hemp extract. There's so many out there these days. It's hard to tell which ones. So that's why the one that I use is Sonicated. 
which means it's even smaller particle than a nano-enhanced liposomal. It means it's sonicated, it's broken down even smaller. So the second you drop it in your mouth, it gets dispersed into your body and you feel a difference so quickly. So you actually have your own blend, don't you, of, of the essential oils and the hemp extract together? I do. I have my own belly blend that I use because if, if the key to wellness begins in the gut, which I firmly believe, then if we treat the gut, if I put essential oils and hemp on my stomach directly, that's going to get absorbed even faster for me. So I started experimenting with that, developed my own blend of essential oils, and then I also take a hemp extract, which is from a different company that I use. So I have a question. What is your life like now? Like, how, how, how is it different from what you were describing at the beginning of the interview? Uh, <laughs> well, it's definitely back on track. Um, I'm still with the same print agency, so that's really good news. And um, I do a lot of these interviews, podcasts, um, really getting the word out to as many people as and guest speaking engagements. Um, it's just really enforcing how we have to take control of our body and not rely on a diagnosis and let that be our life sentence. Let yeah. that be. Yes. Yes. And you've got actually a total gut mastery course, online course for people who don't just want to read a book. They actually want to go through something. I do. I have a six week course and it's really affordable in terms of the information that you get. Um, you get meditation guidelines, affirmations, um, yogic postures that help, um, and then the whole information on the gut broken down on why we focus on the gut, how it functions, and then the tools to use along the way. Fantastic. And for those of you watching, if you want to find out more about Maria's essential oil line or her total gut master course or the essential gut awakening book, we have a link for you. Just go to yourbrilliance.org slash Maria. That's yourbrilliance.org slash Maria. Maria, thank you so much for coming onto the show. And I wondered if you had any last message you would like to leave our viewers with. Yes. When and if you get diagnosed with Hashimoto's or any autoimmune disease, please don't give up. Reach out to somebody who has actually been there and please, I mean, don't rely on those diagnoses to determine the rest of your life. We can change it and we can change it together. Fantastic. Thank you so much. And thank you out there for watching. We hope to see you again soon. Until then, let your brilliance shine.